So we're on our way to this little village here in Rajasthan near Jaisalmer and we made a little stop in the desert because we've been on these camels for a long time and uh, yeah we're just gonna check the sunset out we're in the middle of nowhere these guys are having a break we're having a break apparently you can only get here by a camel I told myself I would never ride a camel again after my experience in Egypt <sighs> but anyways the sun's getting ready to set and uh, yeah I'm not gonna miss it let's go oh look at these beetles These, de these beetles, you can tell where the beetles have been because they leave these, this little track right here. And what they do is they steal poop. That's poop right there. Camel poop. That's why they're hanging out around the camel. They're stealing his poop and they roll it into little balls. And that's how you can trace their little track. And there's their little, their little balls, these little shit bandits. Look, there's another one over there. And if we go over here by the camel's ass, I bet there's... Look at them all, they're all over the place. Flying around, sneaking in. Uh, okay, dude, you ready? I had no words, I had the best words. stopped in the desert before uh, before we head to the village to uh, catch the sunset. What a beautiful sunset. You got sand dunes, the sun, Clara taking selfies, Tom, a more of Lady Ashcore. How stereotypical, like those, you know, those scarab beetles? Yeah. Like from the mummy and shit. So typical. Of course you see those here. Yeah, of course. Pushing dung, like fucking poop balls and shit. And it's like using force and like, you ah, <laughs> They ah, are, they are too. They're using their back. It's hilarious. Should we go see what this little hut thing is? Yeah. You think someone lives here? I'm expecting like a like a witch doctor sort of thing. It's probably just like a white guy. And he has like a like camel bone oh, yeah. carved in his in his nose. Hear a noise, <laughs> of course. Did you hear that? Like this black figure just runs past a peripheral vision, <laughs> and he's like camouflages a bush. Fish. <laughs> <laughs> Must just be like a chill zone. I've seen too many movies. Hey guys, I'm just looking for some shit. No? <laughs> Shit, anyone, please? Look at Clara, ribs, Clara's like there, just in her own universe. <laughs> She's gonna get sucked away by a tornado. Whoa!
too dark for you guys to see. I'll try to show you anyway. This is where we get murdered. <laughs> and our body's buried in our family's own I am 32 years old, but I never fight nothing. In yeah, we listen in television, in computer, in movie phone, Kashmir problem, problem. Mm. But here, no, never. I don't know why Kashmir lot of problem. Mm. I don't know why I remember in the Gospel of Thomas it's it said uh, if you're in like a neighbor's house if anyone invites you in the house that you should always accept their food. It's crazy, huh? Explicitly it's like whatever they they offer you, take it. The Buddha says something similar to, the, to that too. Yeah? That's how he died. <coughs> he knew it was poison but he didn't care. Ratan, what's yes. the name of this village? Chatril. Chatril. Yeah, Chatril. This one, Sangri. Which one's that one? Sangri. What's For it's famous in village. Was that veg? Yeah. Sangri. Uh, this dal, chapati, in mutton or rice. We're going to sleep outside tonight. Under the stars. It's amazing here. Yeah. Oh, yeah, look at that moon. Yeah. Almost full. Yeah. Some kind of. Yeah. Vegetable from the desert. And I think that's dal. Chills the rest. Simple but filling and it tastes good. Sleeping arrangements. It was good. This might be the best I'm not sleep of my on life. The edge. <laughs> 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 wow. Nice. Oh, guys. Yeah, video, huh? Do you... Guys, there was a thing that um, popped up in the bush. I played like these like tones for it, and it appeared in the bush. That Marani, you take Marani of video. Marani. See, it's Marani, you know? What's Marani? Queen. Queen. 
Me? Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, stop. <laughs> <laughs> so is this one of me? Yes. Yeah. Okay. I, I'm cutting in the middle, <laughs> son. You're crazy. <laughs> <laughs> not so bad it's better than what I was expecting people here they don't use toilet paper they just use a little bit of water and their hand wow. don't the crows sound like cats I just realized that dying cat sound was the crows attacking a dying cat. Just kidding, it was a, it was a peacock. I didn't know peacocks made that noise. The crows were carrying around a dead cat. You're nice. kidding. What? Yeah, I am kidding. Cats are evil, so good omen. Right? No? I'm fucking around. <laughs> That's the first thing Tom says when he walks, wakes up. Yeah, cats are evil. Fuck cats. <laughs> it's funny, I had a dream that I was killing a cat. Did you? No. You call them like a massacre. Look at my thumb. I did that with my teeth. What a mania. Jesus. So now we're just waiting for the village people to wake up. Can we get some gimbal shots? Because of the live um, they locked us in though. We're inside of a fence locked in. But I mean, it's hardly a fence that we can't. Oh, you mean locked in? We could yeah. just yeah, yeah, rip down with our pinkies. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Where? You don't see the sun? Oh, shit. You know what I mean? I said about the Oh, damn. Tom, look at the sun, bro. Yeah, I know. Oh, yeah, 
Well, apparently that's re that's how it's supposed to shoot anyway. Yeah, yeah. Because like when you go in this position, it comes out. Yeah, yeah. Teach us. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So wait, step one. Yeah. Wait. Squat. Wait, wait, wait. Step two. Release. Two. Plop, 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 plop. No, 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 no. That's it. So two steps. Oh. Squat and shit. <laughs> What do you do about wiping your ass with those ones that have the one running water? No, they got a little bucket of water in there. They have a bucket of water. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> um, the toilet paper? Where is it? <laughs> in your bag? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> it's so weird. It's so funny that people in India look at us like savages for using toilet paper. Do they? Yeah. They're like, you don't use water? I get it. This is my first time sleeping in an Indian village. Outside. A small cot. Thoughts? Um, it's pretty cool. What do you think? Yeah, awesome. Like sleeping out in nature, I love it. Yeah, I love it. And I love the way these things look. It makes me feel very human. <sighs> and just waking up was much easier. You already got the sun hitting your face. Get out of bed. You're grounded. It's nice. Versus like in an Indian hotel. And then you like you walk out and it's like... Bah, bah, bah. You get like the smell of the sewage. Yeah, exactly. Delhi's like too much. I woke up and Clara was summoning orbs and aliens. Got some early morning chai. Oh. I think I'm a... I'm a wizard, Harry. <laughs> Not for real, yeah. Does that make sense? Yeah, I like the, I like your approach, Tom. It's like removed but caring still. I like that. I could do it being more removed. That's for Tan. That's the only guy that's been taking care of us. He's awesome. Must be a small village. Why not use James? Water in the plants. I didn't even notice there was a little garden there. Mm -hmm. I wasn't admiring it. They just planted them. I actually, yeah, I feel so nervous. That's good for it. Yeah, it is. Is it? Yeah, fuck yeah. Do you think that's why Pissing we feel? Pissing plants good as well. We, do you ever feel like, <laughs> like if there's a plant and, or there's a wall, where would you piss? A piss. Um, it's not piss. A I piss. would piss on a plant. Naturally. 100% of the time, yeah. How, why do we feel that? Is that just nature's way of us watering yes. the plants? Yeah. Just yes. so we have a natural it's probably inclination the, the to just go to that? the plant consciousness, like, moving through us. Yeah. Like, we think it's our like, decision, but it's you. actually the plant the telling plants. us. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Piss on me, bro. I need the nutrients. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> now they do, though. Like, pissing on a lemon tree, it's really good. Makes your lemons all vibrant, and tasty, and juicy. Really? Yeah, it's like, yeah, I give like my it. friends lemon and shit, and I'm like, yeah, do you like the taste of my piss nutrients, bro? <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing, huh? <laughs> do they like the ammonia in it? I don't know. I don't know the science behind it. They just like the smell. <laughs> yes. Thank you so much for letting us stay. Welcome to. This is a beautiful little spot. So these types of huts are actually traditional in Rajasthan. They'll be made of clay and cow dung. These ones look like they might be made out of rock. But traditional ones, maybe the outside layer is cow dung. Grounded. Back, back, back to reality now. <laughs> yeah, back to reality. Finally, we got all the pollution out of the cities. We got one good night, and now we're head, heading back to it. Had the best meal I've had since I've been here in India, which is good. Homemade. Homemade. Locally. Yeah. Locally sourced. It's about as local as you can get. Yeah. Nice protein. Now we're back to eating fried potato and fucking oil.
pretty much. Bread. Chapati. Chapati. What's chapati again? Chapati's like that pita bread type stuff. Oh, yeah. More chapati? What are these made out of? Sorry? What is it made out of? Material. Rock? Rock. Yeah, the huts. These. Yeah, kya hai? Oh, the stone and cement also. Stone and cement. And cement. But this one, in, inside, we make cow shit or some sand, you know? Cow what? Cow shit. Cow shit? Tati. Yeah, tati, <laughs> yes. And uh, we put a special sand mix in cool. water after we make hand. Nice. Yeah. Very cool. So, cow shit and sand. I kept thinking these things right here were demons staring at me. Yeah, I can see that. In the darkness of the night. Shadows from the moonlight. Well, we're leaving the village. Now we're going to head off to Beaconier and see the rat temple.